Birmingham Children's Crusade. The Alabama Children's Crusade, launched by Dr. Martin Luther King and the Southern Christian Leadership Conference, also known as SCLC, brought national and global attention to the civil rights struggle in the United States. On May 2nd, 1963, Black children who were trained in nonviolent tactics walked out of their classes and assembled at the 16th Street Baptist Church to march to downtown Birmingham. More than 700 children protesting racial segregation were arrested, blasted with fire hoses, clubbed by police, and attacked by police dogs. On May 3rd, 1963, Hundreds more children began to march. Commissioner of Public Safety, Eugene Bull Connor, ordered police and firemen to attack the children with high pressure hoses, batons, and police dogs. Images of the children being brutally assaulted by the police appeared on television and in newspapers across the country and world provoking global outrage. Dr. King was also jailed during those protests and in response to criticism, wrote his famous letter from a Birmingham jail. The United States Department of Justice soon intervened. The campaign to desegregate Birmingham ended on May 10th, 1963 with an agreement that SCLC would halt demonstrations in exchange for city officials releasing the jailed protesters and desegregating downtown stores. A week and a half later, the Birmingham Board of Education announced that all children who participated in the march would be suspended or expelled from school a federal district court upheld the ruling, but a U.S. Court of Appeals reversed that decision. A ride to remember, a moment in Black history.